It was the Women's League Cup Final, a battle for glory, a duel that would etch its mark in the annals of the beautiful game. The Molyneux Stadium stood witness, its floodlights casting a dramatic glow. Chelsea and Arsenal, warriors in blue and red, locked horns. 90 minutes, a canvas of tension, skill, and raw determination. But the scoreboard remained silent, teasing both sides with a goalless dance. And so, the match spilled into extra time, where Arsenal's Stina Blackstenius, a name destined for folklore, struck in the 116th minute. As the final whistle echoed, Chelsea's Emma Hayes, a tempest in her own right, erupted. She shoved Arsenal's Jonas Eideval, a clash of wills that defied reason. The touchline became a theater of fire, a canvas for their rivalry. Hayes pointed, her eyes ablaze, as Eideval retreated, bewildered. In the aftermath, Hayes faced the BBC's probing lens. Her voice steady, she declared, there's a way to behave on the side of the pitch. A veteran of women's football, she refused to tolerate male aggression. Fronting up to a player, she emphasized, is unacceptable. And so, dear viewers, the Women's League Cup final etched its tale of passion, rivalry, and the clash that transcended the game. Emma Hayes and Jonas Adeval, two coaches, two visions, forever entwined in football's fiery embrace.